a fancy machine device. You have the best and newest treatment and service and your rep told you, once you add this to your menu, your patients are gonna come running for it. They're gonna be knocking at your door. New patients are gonna be inundating you with wanting an appointment. And what you're finding is, if that is just not reality. It's not as simple as your rep made it sound like it was going to be. Here's the thing, guys, is that you may have done your research and you may, in fact, have the best device or treatment on the market for whatever problem it is that it solves. But your patient, your new patient, they haven't done that due diligence yet to really understand that that is what they need. So it's not as simple as just putting up an ad or sending out an email or a text message, right? Or doing any type of marketing and uh, patients are just gonna come running for it, right? It's not that simple as many of you are finding out because what you have to do to get a patient to make a purchase is overcome three things. So the first thing, number one, is that they have to believe that this treatment can work for them. They have to believe, number two, that you're the person that can get them the result that they are looking for. Because the reality is for most, if not all treatments that all med spas have to offer, they have other choices of where they could get it. So why should they choose you? And the third thing is that you need to show them a vehicle, a way, a pathway in order for them to get it done for themselves. So that could be a scheduling fee, that could be a financial thing, right? So they have to first believe that that specific treatment is gonna work for them. They need to believe that you are the best person um, to give them that treatment. And then the next thing is you gotta show them a way of how it's gonna work for them, whether that's you know a, a lifestyle, a scheduling thing, a downtime thing, a work thing, right? Or if, it, if it's a financial thing. Um, and so if you are able to overcome those three things, uh, then that is when you are really gonna see um, some of your high ticket services starting to move. Now, how do you do that? Well, you need to build trust, authority. And to do that, oftentimes you have to show social proof, right? They wanna know that you have actually done this treatment yourself or on a number of patients and it got amazing results. So you need to have before and after pictures and you need to have you know, video testimonials from patients, not from the manufacturer or the device companies. And I really think that um, patients, consumers are becoming more savvy and be, that makes a difference to them at the end of the day. And a lot of people actually have gotten amazing results for their patients, but they haven't implemented a system of making it a part of their everyday schedule to collect those testimonials, those before and after pictures. And it makes a difference, you guys, at the end of the day. You also need to be educating people on what to expect, why they should choose you over um, other places that they could go to get a, the same or se similar treatments for that matter, right? Um, because people have a lot of choices regarding it, regardless if it's the exact same treatment, why should they choose you, right? If you're in a saturated market that everyone has all the same devices and offering all the same things, why should they choose you? And it doesn't have to always be about price, right? What makes you different and what you make, makes you special? They also need to really like you. What's your likability? How do you communicate? And some of those things could potentially be, you know, what to expect when you come in for your uh, uh, consultation, what to expect when you have the actual treatment, how I'm gonna care for you before the treatment and after the treatment, communicating those things. Because just saying like, oh, we, we, we really love and care 
for our patients. Well, what does that mean? Because everybody says that. And so until you are able to communicate that, verbalize that, um, they're not going to believe you. You're not gonna be separating yourself from all the other choices that they have to offer. And we need to keep that initial excitement that they had when they first saw your ad to get them to show up and get them that much closer to purchasing um, before they even see you, right? And so that is what video content can do for you. Uh, and so if you're one of my clients, then you have received my laundry list of video assets that I want you to create. And that's not something that I can, or frankly, any marketing com company should manufacture for you. Because again, this is where you wanna show your personality. This is where you wanna build trust. This is where you wanna show what makes you different and special. And so while for some, making video is not a comfortable thing, I totally get that. But it's a muscle that you gotta flex, you gotta use. And the more you use it, the more natural that you're gonna become. And I promise you, you are gonna reap the rewards when you start creating content regularly. Um, and even if you don't do it regularly, right? Even if you do a batch of it, then there's technology and automation that you can deliver that content, that message with frequency and consistency. Because we want people um, to show up ready to buy from you, show up ready to ask what your opinion, what your expertise is that you think that they should do to achieve the results that you're looking for. So even if you spent, you know, $150,000 on the best and latest technology and brand name device, what I can tell you is that it's not about necessarily just the device name. That's great. Um, but I have many clients that have the generic non-brand name device that is actually um, getting amazing results from their patients, for their patients, and getting amazing amount of revenue coming in the door, not because of the device, um, but because they have built trust and authority because their patients believe them that they are the person to get the results that they're looking for. And they've shown them a pathway um, to be able to do it with them. So um, you can, or you may not have the brand name device. That's not what is going to, you know, build you a six figure body contouring department. That's not what is gonna get your old therapy or Morpheus aid or, or insert any high ticket service device that you want. That's not what is going um, to get you massive results for your patients or revenue for your med spa. But it's your ability to really build trust and credibility and authority um, to get them to come in and choose you, to come in and trust you um, to take care of them and really to complete the full protocol, the full treatment that's required for them to get those amazing results. And that's when they're gonna win and you're gonna win as well. So you gotta do the work. You gotta do the work upfront in order to reap the benefits of the reward of not only your patients buying your packages or your memberships or your high ticket services, right? Um, but to get amazing results for, for your patients as well. And so you gotta create video content. You gotta build trust and authority before they ever show up, up into your med spot. It all starts, right? Not when they walk through the door, but when they're checking you out online, when they're looking at your organic social media posts, when they see your, when they opt in into your Facebook ad and we begin nurturing them um, with text messages and emails and voicemail drops, right? It all begins before they actually step foot into your med spot. Um, so become a massive fan of video content and I promise you, I promise you, it is gonna pay you dividends in the type of clients and patients that you're gonna attract to your med spa. It's gonna skyrocket your conversion rate in, the, um, in your sales and your high ticket services. 
And then once you start attracting those patients that are doing your high ticket services right, that's when you're gonna see amazing results for your patients too, because they're just not dabbling in some of those um, you know, low entry, low barrier services that are great, right? But those really are more for your maintenance, not for those corrective transformational treatment plans. So um, it's twofold, it's win-win for everyone. So um, make sure that you really, you know, complete the laundry list of educating and building trust with your patient before they ever show up for their first consultation. And I promise you, it will pay you huge dividends. And it's gonna make your marketing work that much better for you.